Welcome back to our channel guys, in today's video I will be showing you how to play Steam game without needing to update the game. So that's a big thing because in Steam you cannot play a game that has an update but not has been updated. So that's a big problem because some games don't even have online functions but you still have to update the game. So in today's video I will be showing you how to bypass a Steam update and enjoy your games. So as you can see here, AimLab has an update, but for whatever reason, you cannot update the game. So first thing you need to do is to make sure that it's not queued for update. If it is, cancel the update, then using system tray, exit Steam and make sure it's not running in the background. Then open the disk that you've installed the game on. For me, it's drive E and then open the steam folder that is your stream library then open the steam apps folder you will see a folder called common that is the folder that contains game files but there's nothing to do there you have to go back and you will see these three acf files that start with app manifest and there is a code after that so those codes are game ids for each game that you've installed and you can know what game id your game has by googling it or basically hovering over the icon of the game for example aim labs game id is 714010 once you find the right file you have to open it with a text editor like notepad that you all have on your computer then you will see something like this. In front of name, it shows the name of the game, so you can make sure that you open the right file. And then the only thing you need to change is the update result. You have to make sure it's set to zero, and then you're basically done. You have to save the file and close everything up, and now you can play whatever game you want to play. Now a few things to know that you can only do this with the games that have offline modes. The second thing is that every time you open Steam in online mode, it will update those ACF files, so it will know that there is an update. So you have to repeat this process every single time you open Steam in online mode. And that's it. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope this was helpful. If it was, make sure you like, subscribe, and that's it. Goodbye.